Hey everybody and welcome to another Learn to Digitize video. My name is Sue and we are, I'm from OML Embroidery and OML Digitizing. And today we're working in Hatch and we're talking about start and stop points. Some people are having a hard time getting them to move. So I'm going to show you guys how to do it. First, let's give ourselves something to work on. So I'm just going to pull out a shape. I just went to digitize, scroll down the menu, pick the square, let go. Whoops, let's do it again. All right pick the square how about we do that there we go now we're cooking with fire let go click again and that is our square now i am in true view mode this kind of messes people up a little bit i like to see the stitches but if you want to see any of the codes or anything that's going on you have to take the true view off it is just simply going to show you the stitches it's not going to show you you know trims or anything like that and all you have to do to change the um the start and stop points you can see we've got codes kind of hidden under there is go to the reshape button and look they appear and you see everything that's going on this here is the angle line and you can change the angle if you want. But for changing start and stop points, you can see this green one here is the start point, and this red cross is the stop point. So all you have to do is grab it and move it. That's all you have to do. So you have to click the reshape button, and that is how you move start and stop points here inside Hatch Embroidery Software. Thank you guys for watching. Please remember to like this video and subscribe to the channel to let me know you want more videos just like this.